Periodontal disease is a serious disease. And while it's a chronic disease, it's, it's a disease that really doesn't, doesn't hurt, it's one that has to be uh, managed at the greatest level and it one that has to be taken with the utmost seriousness. As a periodontist, um, my specialty and training is really in the management of gum disease and, and that which affects the supporting tissues around the teeth. That's generally the bone, the cementum, and specifically the periodontal ligament. The signs of periodontal disease can be difficult to read and they can be a little bit misleading, particularly if somebody has factors that may mask the typical uh, signs and symptoms such as smoking. Um, so typically the signs are going to be bleeding, um, mobility of teeth, bowel odor, a bad breath. Um, uh, these types of uh, conditions are kind of the, the typical hallmark signs of, of, of periodontal disease. The disease is, is not something that, that somebody really needs to fear or really live with. It's something that we can manage, it's something that we can treat, and it's something that we can you know, put patients in a position so they, they don't have to fear losing their teeth, they don't have to fear waking up with you know, bad breath or bleeding gums or feeling, feeling embarrassed or, or being self-conscious about the health of their mouth and wondering if something else is going on with their body contributing to some other systemic condition. And so, um, you know, you can take one of two paths. You can either be proactive and uh, manage your oral health just like you would your systemic health uh, and live life to its fullest, or you, know, you can let these disease processes continue to occur in your mouth, which will ultimately affect your other organ systems on some level, keep limping along, and ultimately um, not live the fullest life with the greatest level of wellness that, um, that, you, that you can.